Hi, I'm Varsha and you're watching this video from justtutors.com. In this video, we are going to learn about Hiran's formula. But before moving to our today's topic, we'll try some warm-up questions. Here are the warm-up questions for you. To try these warm-up questions, you can pause the video. So basically, in first question, you need to find out the perimeter of the triangle. Say this is a triangle. If this is 4 cm, this is 6 cm and this is 8 cm. Since we know that the boundary of a triangle is the perimeter of the triangle, so we need to add the boundary which is 6 cm plus 8 cm plus 4 cm and if we add them all up, the answer is 18 cm. The next is we need to find the area of a triangle. So this is a triangle say. The base length of the triangle is 4 cm and height of the triangle is 2 cm. Since we know that area of triangle is half times base times height which is equal to half base is 4 and height is 2. So the answer is 4 cm square. Now we move ahead and we are going to learn about Hiran's formula. So Hiran's formula is used to find the area of any triangle on the basis of the three sides. But as we know that area of triangle is half times base into height. But we can use this formula only when we know the height. But if we know the three sides of the triangle, let A, B, C a triangle, A, B and C are three sides of the triangle. Then, in that case, we'll use Hiran's formula to find the area of the given triangle. And Hiran's formula says that under root S, S minus A, S minus B, S minus C, where S is equal to half of the perimeter. So, if A, B, C are the sides of the triangle, then perimeter is A plus B plus C. And the value of S is A plus B plus C over 2 where A, B, C are the sides of the triangle. Now we move ahead and we'll try one question on it. And the question says that if A, B is 4 cm, B, C is 3 cm and A, C is 5 cm, then what would be the area of the triangle? So first of all, we'll calculate the value of S, which is 4 add 3 add 5, which is equals to 12 cm over 2. So the value of S is 6 cm. Now we know that the Heron's formula is S times S minus A times S minus B times S minus C. So the value of S is 6. So S is 6. S minus A is 6 minus 3 which is 3. S minus B is 6 minus 5 which is 1. S minus C is 6 minus 4 which is 2. So this is going to be 36. And we can write 36 as under root 6 times 6. So the answer is 6 cm square. Now we move ahead and here are some practice questions for you. To try these practice questions, you can pause the video. Now here are the answers of the practice questions. You can match the answers. And I must say that you are working really well in understanding the Hiran's formula. Thank you for watching the video. For more, please visit justtutors.com.